Hello everyone, Rich here, back for part 5 of this RMS Empress of Ireland tutorial. Uh, today's focus is the ship's stern deck details. Uh, cranes, masts, uh, vents and all sorts of things like that. There's a cargo hatch as well thrown in. Uh, we'll build the forward mast as well. Uh, and uh, any other detail I can think of along the way we shall do. So, plenty to do, but uh, we're going to focus on the back end first. We're going to fly to the back end of the uh, ship first. <coughs> Excuse me. And we shall begin there. So we're going to go to got this upper deck here on the stern, and we're going to go to the centre block of the back wall. So the back wall of the bottom deck, or the back wall of the uh, bottom superstructure rather, which is on this deck here. We're going to go to the centre block, and we're going to count to the twelfth block back. So from the centre block of the back wall, twelfth block back. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And on that 12th block we put a coloured centre block, although not really necessary because it's only a small building. And we're going to build it 5 wide, so it's uh, 2 that side and 2 that side. Sides are 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and then join them together like so. There's your foundation. And then you build this to 3 blocks high, so just build it all the way around. 3 blocks high, it's just a small deck house that supports the... Uh, the stern mast and we'll add that later on as well so get the uh, deck house out of the way and it should look something like that and then for the roof you can either use quartz uh, or wood blocks which I'm going to use so I'm going to use wood blocks for the roof and we'll add the wood decking in there and it should look something like that don't look too bad do it nothing special but you know uh, so what we can do after that is add a couple of windows so I'll add a couple of windows to the front like so, and then the same on the back. And then for the sides, we can add a pair of doors. Uh, I put one on the front, one at the back, like so, and then a window in the middle. So I haven't got doors selected, so that's always something I need. So I put a door there, and a door there. So that's the left side, and on the right side, we do the same. So a door, door, and a window in the middle, like so. So there we are, there's our deck house. And the mast, when it's being built, will sit directly in the centre on the top. So the mast will go there, and we'll uh, add that later on. <coughs> Excuse me. So what we're going to do now is add the cargo hatch. So we'll go to the back wall of the uh, deck house we just built. And we're going to leave a three block gap. So one, two, three. And on the fourth block we build our hatch, which is nine wide. So that's centre block plus four that way, and four that way. And the sides are eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then join them together across the back. And then for the hatch itself, uh, it's up to you how you want to do this one. On the prototype, I basically just put slabs along the top for the cover. So if I get the quartz slabs again, we'll just do the same thing again. So no real special treatment for this one. We'll just add slabs across the whole uh, body of the... Uh, hatch and because I haven't got the code for the for the slabs I'm gonna have to do it all freehand so <laughs> this may take a few minutes and there we go there's the hatch done so it's basically a slab cover like so and there we are that's that done Right, so I'm just going to get my notes and work out what to do next, so bear with me on this one. Um, so for the next job, we're going to add a couple of crane bases. So we're going to go to the back of the hatch, which is this one here, and we're going to leave a four block gap. So one, two, three, four, and then put a centre block there. So I'll put a red centre block, and then we're going to count five out. So one, two, three, four, five, and then we build our crane body so that's five out that way and then one two three four five out the other way so there's where our crane bases will go so I work on the right hand one here so I put three and then five 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 and three like so and then we do the same on the other one so it's uh, three and then five 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 and then three, so it's sort of a symmetrical thing all the way around, so it's three on either side basically. And it should look something like that. So you've got the two bases like that, 
And for the crane bodies, are uh, eight blocks high. So we'll go from the centre block, which is this point. We'll build the crane body eight blocks high. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then build that three wide, like so, like that. And then at the top, facing towards the back, we'll put a counter uh, counterweight. Sorry, like that. Basically, three white, uh, three blocks, like so. And then we'll put a centre spur down the middle of the back, like so. So it's sort of shaped like that. So it's three wide, and then you've got a centre beam at the back there like that. And you can sort of add an extra three blocks at the top if you want as well to make it a bit more uh, more shapey to it. But it's up to you. And then for the crane arm, we go to the third block up from the base. So one, two, three. And the crane arm is... Uh, I think it's ten. In, it's ten. So from the other side, we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, like so, and then four in the middle. One, two, three, four, like that. So that's your crane, pretty much done like that. So you can add a bit more detail to it if you want to, like iron bars for the chains and things like that. But that is just the basic crane done there. So that is. That little jobby done there. So I did the same on the other side and I'll do it as quick as I can. So the centre is eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Triple that. Like so. And then our centre beam. Plus the overhang at the back. Like so they look the same. And then for the arm itself it's three above the B at the base. One, two, three, and then ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, plus the 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. And there we go. That's both cranes done there. So that's our little job. Right, now we need to work on the next job, which is we'll remove that centre block between the two cranes, because we no longer need them. And we're going to go back to the hatch up here, and we're going to count to the 12th block back. So... No, 13th block back. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, which is that one. And we're going to build. Uh, we'll go out, do two out from the side. So we go, that's the centre block, and we'll go two out that way. And we'll build our base for our um, vent. So I'll put a, a base shape like that, and then one out to the side as well on the other side. Put a base shape there. So you've got two vent shapes like that. And the vents themselves are three high, I think, so one, no, that's already one high, so two, three, plus one at the back, and then we add quartz stairs, which we're going to find on the top, like so, and then another one facing forward, like so. So you've got the uh, funny shaped vents like that, similar to what we had on the Titanic uh, back in all those months ago. And we do the same on the other side, <coughs> excuse me, two up, plus the one at the back court stairs on the top and another block forward like so and then we can remove that centre block like so and there's our two vents and then we go back to the hatch again and we count to the 15th block back or if we go back to the centre block between the two uh, the, the two vents we're going to leave another three block gap so one so that was the 13th block so we want 14 15 and on the 16th block is where we so basically, it's a it's, it's a two block gap back from the uh, centre block between the two vents. That's how it's meant to be. So, two block gap. We build again, and this is going to be uh, another hatch. No, this is going to be a skylight. Sorry, and it's going to be three wide, like so. And the sides are four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and join them together. And then we build it two blocks high. Like so, and then we add stairs around the top. It's very similar to the to the ha uh, to the skylights we had on the top. So just use stairs around the top, and there we go. There's our uh, skylight plus the glass on the top, like so. And there we are. That's our skylight done, and it don't look too bad. <coughs> excuse me. Right, so <coughs> excuse me. So what I'm going to do now is leave a six block gap from the back of the skylight so one two three four five six and on the seventh block is where we build and we're going to build a three wide two side square like that so it's a basically a nine square and then we build that three high 
and that will support our docking bridge. So that's you can see it's a three, three by three all the way around, three blocks high, basically a Rubik's cube, like so. And then on the top we add a line of wood blocks like so, through the middle, and then a white block on the back, and a white block on the front. And these are the centre points of the docking bridge. So let's try and work out how to do this one. So the docking bridge uh, is going to curve, it curves sort of backwards like a boomerang. So it's going to the front is. Uh, 13 so that's six other sides so one two three four five six that way one two three four five six that way and then we want four one two three four four again one two three four and then three one two three and then two one two and then back three one two three like so so you can see it's curving backwards towards the tip of the stern so do the same the other side four one two three four four again one two three four and then three one two three and then two one two and back three one two three so there we are that's both sides and then we we'll go back to the center block on the back now and the back is eleven wide so that's five either side so one two three four five that way one two three four five that way and then we want uh, four four one two three four one two three four and then three one two three and then two one two like so is that right can't be right can it uh four four three two well i imagine that that would do <laughs> actually we'll get rid of that and make that just four and then we go that makes it a bit more uh well it's up to you how you want to do this if you want to build it like so and then have the extra two there is up to you so I think what I think that would work better actually if we go four four three four 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 three two or four four three three I'll do the same on the other side and we'll try and work out how this goes so I put four four one two three four one two three four and then go three one two three and then three one two three there we go that that works better because what I've written down here is not corresponding to what I've got here but what I've just done there it looks better anyway so it's from the front of the back it's 11 wide then four four three three. Then we go. And then four four three three on the other side. And there we go. That is our docking bridge sort of done. And then what we do on the inside, we'll just add the wood decking or whichever material you want to use. I'm just going to use wood decking because it's what I have available. And it should all look nice and neat and all things sweet. I use well did it for this bit, so I use fill for this one. So fill wood by to 30,000 whatever and there we go that's our wood decking added there so you can sort of see it's sort of it's sort of like a rear spoiler basically on a ship uh, looks a bit weird but there you go and underneath the uh, the, the uh, docking bridge itself uh, so if we go I'm trying to think how to do this actually sort of sort of put them at random really because I can't exactly pinpoint where we need to put the, the supports but if we go sort of from the outside edge sort of four in and then add a sort of supporting beam about two blocks thick it's, it's like I say it's, it's hard to pinpoint where exactly it needs to go but I'm just sort of putting it at random so that's sort of a third block fourth block in from the side so one two three four I think about there like so I think that will do yeah, I do. I think it's hard, it's, like I say, it's hard to pinpoint exactly where they go, but you know you can uh, adjust it as much as you want. And then what we'll do on the centre block of the back of the uh, of the uh, docking bridge, we'll put some stairs. So we'll remove centre block and the centre wood block, and we'll put stairs in. So we'll get our stair blocks, and we'll put stairs on the there and then down there, preferably the right way up, and then a white block underneath. Stairs. And then a white block underneath plus stairs, and there we go. And then the banisters two up, two up, one, and then two up, two up, one, like so. And then on the sides of the stairs at the top, we just remove two wood blocks and put white blocks in the middle, like so. And there we are. There's our docking bridge. We'll come back and put the handrails around that in a minute. But first, we've got another job to do on the stern here, and it's on this little sort of little sticky out platform at the back here we're going to go to the corner blocks which is this point here 
so where the uh, sticky out end starts to stick out we're going to build uh, a three block tower like so and then another three block tower opposite like so and then using quartz, quartz stairs we're going <coughs> to we're going to build an archway so i put stairs and then upside down stairs and then stairs on the top like so and the same the other side stairs upside down stairs and then stairs like so and then a block in the center like so and there we are that's that is that section there and uh, it don't look too bad in my opinion uh, so there we go that's that little jobby done and what we'll do we'll add the handrails around the uh, docking bridge for the minute so I'll we'll just go around the docking bridge without doing too much damage There we go, that's the docking bridge done there. You can add a few more details to it, like uh, telemotors and other things like that, but that is really all we're going to do uh, with the uh, docking bridge. And uh, that's that. So one more job to do while we're here before I do another jump cut, or do a jump cut. We're going to go to the mast, the, uh, the stern mast here, and we're going to build it four rows of 15 high. So that is one, two, three high. So we want 15. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and then another 15, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and then 15 again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 13, 14, 15, there we are, so it's four rows of 15 like so, and then back down to the third 15 up so this, this third one here or the bottom of the top 15 whichever and we're going to go and build five out so one two three four five plus a black block and another yellow block and then we do the same on the other side one two three four five black block and then yellow block like so and there we are that's our mast done there and then we go back down to the bottom of the mast and build the two cranes attached to it so third block up from the bottom, one, two, three, and then we build uh, two rows of ten. So ten back, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And on top of that, ten again, one, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Same on the other side, two rows of ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And there we go, and then we can remove two blocks there and replace them with black. This is just my design, by the way, as it's just something that I do. And uh, that's our little jobby done there. So that's what we've got done so far. There's still more to go on, but uh, like a li lifeboats and other things. But we'll worry about that another day. Uh, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to do a jump cut while I work on, well, work out what to do next, and then uh, we can move on from there. So um, back in a moment. Right. So back again. And what we're going to do now is add a few staircases. But before we do that, I'm going to add a few, um, well, what I call mechs. They're basically just a lump of black blocks really uh, either side of this stern skylight here so we're going to go roughly one block out from the side of that and build uh, sort of three and then three and then three across like that and do the same on the other side so one two three one two three and one two three like so this is basically sort of pulleys and things for said mast and cranes and things like that and we'll add one behind the uh, docking bridge as well so uh, one, two, three across, one, two, three across, one, two, three along, <coughs> sort of like that, and uh, that's really all we need. And then what we're going to do is add some staircases. Now these staircases go along the back uh, of the superstructure, and we're going to start on the bottom, uh, or the, you know, the, the lowest one anyway, bottom deck, and we're going to go f to the eleventh block in from the edge. So we we'll start on the right, and we we'll count eleven in. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and then <coughs> remove centre block and one wood block, and then we build our stairs down. So stairs plus a block plus stairs plus a block plus stairs. 
plus a block plus stairs like so so there's our stairs in place and then we just build the banisters two up two up and one and then two up two up and one like so and there's our stairs and then we'll remove side blocks and replace them with white and there we go there's our first staircase and we'll do the same on the other side I'll do the, the next one up first and then I'll do the ones on the other side because they're just in the same position 11 blocks in from the side but I'll do them in a minute so go to the next deck up and we'll do the same again this time it's 11 blocks in uh, no seven blocks in from the side so one two three four five six seven and then remove the center block or remove that white block and then the wood block and then another wood block like so, so we're going a bit deeper in this time excuse the pun and then uh, stairs plus a block plus stairs plus a block preferably white ones and then stairs again and then another block and then stairs again like so so the stairs are a bit uh, further back and then we'll add the banisters two up two up and one again same on the other side two up two up and one and then as before we'll remove two wood two wood blocks replaced with white other side and there we go there's our other staircase the reason that that's that's further back like so or a bit deeper into the deck is because it's the space restriction really. you've only got a couple of blocks space here so that's why that goes back a bit further so that's those two decks done there so I should I should do a copy paste now to the other side because like I said they're both in the same position on both sides so just stand here and use the copy paste so uh, copy flip to the right and then we paste like so and then we have both sides done like that and they don't look too bad do it <coughs> excuse me so that's those two little jobbies done so what we're going to do now is fly to the front end of the ship and put the forward mast in now so that's something we, we put the foundation for it in in part in the in part four so for part five today we're going to build the mast up and it's the same design as on the back it's four rows of 15 so that's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen and one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen so there we are there's our four rows of fifteen and then same as same with the back end go down to the top of the fourth of the third 15 sorry and then build out this time I build out three one two three plus a black block and then another yellow block same on the other side one two three so on, that was a bit of lag there so one two three plus a black block and then another yellow block like so and there we go that's that little mast bit done there then we'll fly back down to the bottom now and put on the uh, crane supports and we're going to go to the fifth block up from the bottom so one two three four five and put a block on either side like that and then we're going to build 19 forward from this point so it's 20 in total so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen <laughs> same on the other side two three four five no damn it one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, like so. And then we just put the two black blocks in the ends like so. And there we are. And then we go back to the to the beginning again at the mast. Go two blocks up, so one, two, and then we build two blocks back like that. And then two blocks back again. Like so, so two back, two back. And then we build up three rows of seven. So we go up one one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven same on the other side one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven one two three four five six seven and then at the top remove two yellow blocks and replace them with black <coughs> like so and it should look something like that and then for the ma uh, not the mast, the uh, crow's nest will go, say the top section of the of the bottom 15. So this is the bottom 15 here. We'll add the the crow's nest roughly here. So one block down from the top of that, we'll build sort of two out, no three out. Sorry, so three forward and then one across, and then we we'll just put a block underneath like so, to make it a very basic crow's nest. So you got basically no no room to move, but 
you know, it does its job nonetheless. So that's our cruise. And this kind of looks like a bathtub sticking out or a toilet attached to a uh, attached to a pole, but you know, that's that. And I think we'll leave the mast as it is. So we've got the two masts in place now. The ship kind of looks weird without the funnels, but we'll add them another day. Uh, and what we'll do, we'll go <coughs> back onto the top deck and we're going to add a few vents. Now there's going to be, I don't know how many there are, um, but uh, we shall see how we go. So what we're going to do, we're on the back end of the top superstructure, I'm going to go to the back wall of the large skylight here. So this huge skylight, we're going to go to the back wall, which is here. And along the line of that, we're going to go one block out from the side. So one block, no, two block gap. So one, two blocks out. And we're going to put our um, vent base in. So this is on the left hand, no, this is on the right hand side. Sorry. So I'm going to work on the right and then I'll copy it over to the left. So it's both, the, it's the same on both sides. Okay. So I'm, I'm just working on the right here. So we'll go one, two, third block out and we'll put our base in, which is basically across like that. And then the bottom, the back is three high. The sides are three high, like so. And then we we'll use uh, stairs on the back, and then stairs again, and then a block in the middle, plus another set of stairs, like so. So it looks something like that. You got th three pillars of three high, plus stairs on the back and stairs on the sides, and then two on the front, one, two up like that, or just one on there. And then we go uh, two forward two forward, two forward, and I think that is right, so build that up two and then build one forward, that's right. And then we'll add stairs on the sides, stairs underneath, like so, and there we are, there's our large vent, like so, so that's that one done, <coughs> excuse me, and it should look, in theory, something like that, it kind of looks like a large upturned toilet, if you like. Plenty of toilets today, is there? Strange thing that. Right, so that's that one, and then we're going to leave a. Uh, what we're going to do? We're going to leave a, a gap of eight blocks. So an eight block gap from the front of the uh, from from the front base. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and on the ninth block, we build our next vent. So that's that one there. So it's the same design again. So build it three high on the side like so across the back there and we add stairs 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 and stairs and then there three up at the front and then uh, two forward two forward two forward and one forward plus our stairs like so and there we go <coughs> excuse me that's our second vent so we've got those two, <coughs> excuse me, I've got a bloody cough right now. So that's our two two vents. So you do the same on the other side, so they'll be in the same position. So what we're going to do now is leave a 15 block gap. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And on the 16th block, we'll do the same again. So same design. So two up there, two up there, two up there, plus one and one. And then stairs, 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 and stairs. Two up at the front, and then two forward, two, f two forward, two forward, and one forward underneath, plus the stairs on the bottom, top, and sides, or whatever. <coughs> there we go. That's vent number three. And then after that, we want another fifteen gaps. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, and on the 16th block, same again. So, vent, base, like so, and then two up at the sides, two up at the back, and one in the middle there, plus two at the front, and then stairs, 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 and stairs, and then two forward, two forward, two forward, and then one at the bottom, and then these stairs, making it round. So that's another vent. That's four vents now. That should be eight in total with the ones on the other side. <coughs> Excuse me. And then we want uh, a 32 block gap. Now this will go, if you're counting from the base, you're going to have to go over the top of the deck house there. So it's a 32 gap. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 
12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. And I might mark that a second, make sure I'm in line. And I'm out by one, so it's there. So that's 32. And on the 33rd block is actually where we build. So that's 30, 32 block gap from the front of the previous event. Of course, you've got to go over the deck house to count it, but that's the next one in position there. So that's, like I say, a 32 gap. And then we build the base again. That's the same design. Two up at the sides, two up at the back, plus a middle one, and two up at the front. Stairs, 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 and stairs. And then we go two forward, two forward, two forward, and one. And then stairs underneath, top and sides. Like so. <clears throat> and it should look something like that. So you have the same on the other side as well, so it'll be symmetrical. And there will be more uh, vents to go on top of the, the, the bridge later on as well. As you can see on the prototype over there, you can just see where the crosshairs are, sort of. There's a pair of vents there, but they'll be added later on because uh, they'll be pa they're paired together on the top of the, uh, of the ship's wheelhouse. But like I say, they'll be added later on. So I'm going to do a quick copy-paste to get these two vents, or these two sets of vents over. So we've got... How many is it? One, two, three, four, five. So there's five in total this side. So there should be ten in total once you've got them on both sides as well. So I'm just going to quickly copy and paste them to the other side. So we will have ten in total. So we'll do the usual copy, flip, and paste. And there we go. That's the ten on the or the five on the other side. So that's ten in total now. And should look something like that so the ship is definitely filling up a bit more but when you get the the lifeboats and the ma uh, lifeboats the funnels and the other details in place it will be quite full so that's that so that's really all I'm going to do for today but we've got the masts vents and the stern details done so it's not looking too bad so we have got quite a bit done so I'm just going to pop over to the prototype and you can see the detailing that uh, will be done so you can see you got the vents, you got a pair of smaller vents which I missed out but we'll worry about them later on but you can see all the big vents on the prototype here and you can see all the other details as well, they're sort of uh, well there's mechs and uh, these other things here and uh, more mechs and other details as well on top of the wheelhouse you can see the two vents there as well just on top of the wheelhouse so they'll be added later on as well plus two vents by the docking bridge uh, by the um, bridge wing, sorry, on the front they'll be added later on as well so still plenty to go, but uh, they'll be for another day. So um, we're going to call it a day now. So this is part five over and done with. Uh, part six will probably be the continuation of the details that we started here. Plus a few windows as well. Cause there's windows to go across the front plus down the side as well. Um, maybe the funnels, I'm not sure. But I'm, try I'm trying to leave the funnels till last because you know, they're usually added last anyway. But we'll see. And... Uh, I'll leave it at that. So this is Rich signing off, logging off, disappearing. And I shall return in part six. So uh, bye for now.